New York was the safest big city in America for several decades. A lot of hard work done by a lot of people. I lay the problems in New York City solely at the feet of Bill de Blasio. He has eviscerated the, the police department. The future is, quite frankly, very bleak in New York, certainly for the next 18 months under the de Blasio administration. Warning there, former NYPD Commissioner Ray Kelly blaming New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio for a rise in violent crime on his watch, saying the mayor's policies have eviscerated the police department and demoralized officers, leading to calls for de Blasio to be removed from office. New York City Councilman Joe Borelli joins us now. He voted against de Blasio's budget, including a $1 billion cut to the NYPD budget. Uh, Joe, good morning to you. Thanks for being here. Uh, the reference for him to step down is coming from Lee Zeldin, obviously, a congressman from New York and some others. What do you see happening in New York? Can the situation improve like this or does it only get worse? Well, it's tough to see how it gets worse. I mean, we've had a year of, of systematic uh, defunding and, um, and and crawling back of our NYPD, and, and it's tough to see how that would be undone uh, by de Blasio over the next couple of months. Look, Sandra, I've lived in this city 38 years of my life on Earth, uh, and I have never seen a time where there was such a universal chorus of people demanding one specific leader of this city, the Mayor de Blasio, resign. I mean, it is coming from both the right and the left. The right obviously sees these headlines on the front page of every paper every single day uh, seemingly hitting a new milestone of death, uh, violence, and destruction. And, and surprisingly, Sandra, the left actually thinks he's not even going far enough. I mean, this is, this is the, the, the 2020 uh, that, that we really have come to, to just really see every single night on the evening news as looters and rioters and shooters continue to act with impunity uh, in yeah. this city that was once, I mean, for 30 years, Sandra, we were, we were on a good track record. Uh, and as Ray Kelly pointed out, I mean, he's someone who served two mayors. I mean, this is probably not going to end at any point in the next 18 months while Mayor de Blasio is still in office.